able to structure how I think about including carers and families. It gave me a kind of a real simple way to explain the positive um, benefits of actually including family and carers. It started off kind of quite dry for me in terms of a strategic meeting. It's grown into something that actually just feels much more real and natural because it's about the people I work with, it's the carers I've met, it's the relationships I've got with the carers I know. It's explaining that to staff and seeing that actually affect their practice in a way that's been much more helpful. So it's moved from something that's just been a kind of a model and something we kind of mark ourselves against to actually being um, a really good way of working. It kind of it overlaps with things like risk assessment and risk planning. So if we're thinking that carers are a protective factor in terms of someone's risks, then the better quality engagement we have with carers, the better quality someone's risk planning is. About care planning as well, and we're doing a lot of work at the moment about collaborative care planning. And again, if we've got those skills with us within um, communicating effectively with carers, engaging them, having those more positive relationships with carers right from the beginning, so kind of very early on, improves our care planning. Um, and again, at the point that when we're discharging somebody, we've got those relationships to kind of then the, um, the trust is there in around in round sort of discharge planning. So I would encourage um, any team or staff member to get involved with um, trying on care by starting off to actually get to know the carers that are involved with their team, get to kind of know who they are, hear some of their experiences, and just to hear again from a carer's point of view what it's like to be supporting someone with a mental health condition and kind of giving that kind of real life experience about what that's like, which is inspiring to staff and just remind staff again about the, where that person sits within their family and the impact that has.